Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's morning English. This is Colin. This is Winter. 大家好，欢迎大家来到今天的早安英文。Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。Today we're going to talk about false advertising.、Mm -hmm. It's everywhere. Yeah, yeah. I have a lot of students that、uh, they ask me how to say that this advertisement is、uh, 假的，骗人。对，有的时候话到嘴边想不起这个英文该怎么说。那我们今天呢，就来聊一聊啊，就是当我看到现在这种铺天盖地的、非常夸张的这种广告宣传的时候，哎，我可以怎么用英文来表达这个广告是很夸张的？我觉得很很很耸人听闻的哈。The first thing I would say is this ad is full of it. Full of it. Full of it. 乱说就是夸大其词的。This ad is full of it. You are so full of it. You are so full of it. 你胡说。Or the celebrity in the advertisement is so full of it. 就是说这个广告里的这个明星啊，就是。有些明星在广告里面也是胡说八道。Mm -hmm. The celebrity in the advertisement is so full of it. But what does it mean in this sentence? Like full of full it. Full of what? Right.、Like、full of what? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why is it here? <laughs> well, it it comes from a word I can't say on the podcast. It's a it's a a bad、S、word. <laughs> yeah, you <laughs> know,、uh, full of bull bleep, full、uh -huh. of dog. Bleep,、uh -huh. and you know it's、uh, I T、uh -huh. S H I T,、uh -huh. right?、Uh -huh. So when we say full of it, everybody knows that we mean that word, but we can't say it because maybe、uh, in some places you shouldn't use words like that. Ah,、uh, 对，就像我们不能说你你傻什么，我们就把那个音消掉，然后我们会说。你傻缺，对吧？ Yeah, <laughs> 就是换一个词啊， yeah. uh, 我们就不说那个脏字，而就只是用 it 来代替，就是 full of it. Yeah,、like mm. I'm not going to say that around my mother. I would just say full of it, right? Now this is spoken English, and it's not something that we would write very often. 嗯哼，这就是一个非常典型的，我们只在口语里面使用的一个非正式的表达。所以大家写东西的时候，千万不能够用。That's right. 而且大家不知道注意到没有哈，这个短语里面 full of it 它是有连读的 full of it. Yeah, of of course, it's three separate words full of it, but we say it together almost as it's as if it's one word full of it, full of it, full of it, full of it. That's right. That's right. And there's a similar one, right?、Uh, full of hot air. That's right. Full of hot air, and it can be used any place. Full of it is used, but we're replacing it, and we all know what the it is with hot air. So it's nicer, friendlier. Uh huh. So it is full of hot air. You can use directly to replace full of it, and it will be full of it. Listening to it will be more friendly. Yeah, 礼貌一点，嗯、yeah. mm. ，interchangeable。对，然后 hot air， 大家想是热的空气，就是热的气。你嘴里出来的热的气，其实就是你说话的时候会出气嘛，对吧？对，嗯、mm -hmm. ，所以它的意思也是，就是说废话。That's right。就是喷气， right. yeah. 你在喷气，对，你在说废话。She is full of hot air。That's right。So she's full of it, or she is full of hot air. And now we could also say her claims. Are overinflated, right? Overinflated. 这个词的意思就是呃，夸张的，夸大的，就是言过其实的。Right. Well, the verb inflate means to fill something, usually with air, but it can be other things, like filling a balloon with air. Now, overinflate is when you put too much air in it. With a balloon, you'll break the balloon. 嗯哼 ，inflated 这个词呢，它其实单独啊，也可以用来表示夸张的、言过其实的。然后，比方说 
he has an inflated sense of his own importance. Yeah, 就是他自视过高，把自己看的就是很重要。Yeah, yeah, and we use it、uh, in the same way with the term ego.、Um, he has an inflated ego. He has an inflated ego. 就是他特别骄傲，就是把自己看的特别高。同样的意思 ，inflated ego， 固定搭配哈，大家可以记下来。Now. Overinflated is used much the same way as inflated, but it's to the extreme when it's really too too much. Uh、mm-hmm. huh. So inflated, 单独它可以表示夸张的。那前面再加上 over， 就是超过的，就是更加夸张的。就等于说把这个夸张的程度啊推到了极致。Mm-hmm. Overinflated, like their testimonies are overinflated. 就是他们的这个证词啊。That's、太夸张了，极度夸张。That's right. That's right.、Um, testimony, by the way, in in advertisement, refers to、uh, some customers talking about how they use the products and how good they are. Ah,、uh, testimony 呢，就是我们看到很多广告里面不是会呃，很多时候请很多这个用过这个产品的人来说，哎呀，这个东西有多好，然后我用了之后有多么多么神奇。这种广告就叫做证言式的广告哈，所以英文里面呢就叫做 testimony。那 testimony 这个词呢，它本身就是证言、证词。比方说你在法庭上作证，这个证言也叫做 testimony。Yeah, a lot of testimonies in advertisements are. Overflated, you know, it's really just a nice way of saying they are lies. 对，其实就是你说啊，他们是骗人的。只是呢，我们不说的那么直接，我们用另外一个词，他们很夸张，太夸张了 ，overinflated. Mm-hmm. Or we can say they are exaggerating, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, uh, this product is really horrible, and I'm not exaggerating. 就是我不是夸张啊，这个产品真是。太差了。This product is really horrible, and I'm not exaggerating. That's right. Yeah, That's this right. product is really disgusting, and I'm not exaggerating. That's right.、Mm-hmm. Well, when you say something with an extreme term and you really mean it, you might say, "I'm not exaggerating. This is the worst movie I've ever seen, and I'm not exaggerating." 这是我看过最差的一部电影。我真不是夸张。This is the worst movie I've ever seen. And I'm not exaggerating. You could use the adjective form of this word as well, exaggerated. Ah,、uh, 就是这个词的形容词形式 exaggerated, 呃，夸张的，夸大的，言过其实的，也是很常用的 Yeah, yeah.、Uh, she made exaggerated claims in her advertising. Ah,、uh, he spoke with an exaggerated New York accent. That's right. That's、uh, right. 他说话的时候有特别夸张的纽约口音 Yeah, but it, it can have.、Um, In in this case, he spoke with an exaggerated New York accent. It can have two meanings,、uh, very close but a little different. One is、um, his accent is very heavy, very strong, but the other is his accent is fake strong. Hmm. 就是我们说一个人的口音 exaggerated 很夸张，可以说呢是啊、呃、是说他本身讲话这个，比方说纽约口音很。很重，也可以说呢，是他故意就是说一个非常夸张的口音，就是故意去 fake 一个口音。嗯、right. mm-hmm. ，Last thing to talk about today, um, I found that it's difficult for Chinese students to use proper adverbs to describe how exaggerated the claim is, like the extent of exaggerating. Oh, you mean how most people here use? Very, 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 or so, 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 all the time. Yes, because we in Chinese, we say, "Ah, very exaggerated, very exaggerated." So, we often have students say, "Ah, when they say exaggerated, they think very exaggerated, very so exaggerated." That's right.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. But it's not good to always use "very" and "so" in front of "exaggerated." No. Or exaggerated, right? No, no.、Um, well, look. Let me just、uh, give you a few examples、uh, of how you can use other adverbs with the exaggerated. Sounds perfect. Okay. So the first one is highly. So highly exaggerated. Highly exaggerated. 很夸张 That's right.、Mm-hmm. Second one, vastly. So vastly exaggerated. 
vastly exaggerated. Right. 也是特别夸张 That's right.、Mm-hmm. Grossly, grossly exaggerated. Grossly exaggerated. 极度夸张，极其夸张 Good. And one more. Wildly. So, wildly exaggerated. Wildly, wildly, wildly exaggerated. 也是极其非常的夸张。嗯，所以呢 ，Colin 给我们介绍了四个副词哈，我们可以把它放在 exaggerated 这个前面，来表示非常特别夸张的意思。Highly, vastly, grossly, wildly. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语，听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。Thank you for listening to today's morning English. This is Colin. This is Winter. See you next episode. See you.